So everybody wants to later. And sit in your chair, feet on the ground. And we'll take just a moment here to check in with your, how you're doing this morning. And my voice feels really raspy, um, just from talking a lot and probably some of the pollen. So just like notice the qualities of yourself today. See if you can take in a deep breath. So as you inhale, fill your lungs up. And as you exhale, soften, relax, release tension. And just take a couple rounds of just checking in and breathing. And keep your hands on your lap, on your belly. Maybe say this to yourself. May this practice nourish me. May this practice bring me relaxation. May this practice bring me hope. May this practice give me joy. Lean your right ear to your right shoulder. You can keep your eyes closed for this. Maybe just notice what it feels like to turn your head to the right side. Lift your head up back through center. Bring your shoulders up to your ears and then lower your shoulders down. Bring your left ear to your left shoulder. Taking a breath or two here, try to relax. And then gently bring your head back through center. Lift both shoulders up. And then exhale, both shoulders down. Do that two more times. Lift your shoulders up to your ears and down and up and down. Last one, shoulders come up, exhale, relax. Take your arms out to the side, spread out your fingers, maybe wiggle them. And then crisscross them in front of you, give yourself a hug. Open the arms back out, maybe bring your arms behind you this time. Switch arms, which one's on top, give yourself another hug. And open the arms back out and lower them down. Bring your shoulders back up to your ears, push them back this time, then down, then forward. So creating like this little box-like shape. We're gonna do some shoulder stretches this morning. So one, I'm kind of warmed up. <laughs> And moving them around a bit before we do any of them. Good. And now we're going to take your um, whatever you have, tish, dish towel or washcloth, it doesn't really matter. And just take them about shoulder width. Hopefully it's long enough that you can come about shoulder. Um, that if this was about the least, at least the length of your shoulders are about. <laughs> And we'll start with them on our knees. Bring your head up, straighten your back. And then inhale, inhale, inhale. Go up as far as you like, but keep your chin center so you can even tuck it in. And then exhale, exhale, bring it down. Touch it to your lap. Inhale. 
Exhale. Beautiful. Inhale. Exhale. See if you can go back a little further. Don't force it, but maybe even bend the elbows and lower it down. Two more. Close your chest forward, arms go back and down. Last one. And hands come down and just lay this on your lap. We'll come back to it in a second. Bring your hands to prayer and then point your fingers forward and then point them back towards you. So we're just circling the wrist. Push the hands around, just cut a little half circle here. And using just some pressure, light pressure. So palm pressing into palm. And you should feel your forearms, these muscles right here working. And your shoulder blades. So back here, when you press palm into palm, you'll feel a little tension there. Good. Now we're just gonna circle it out like your patty cake hands. Just kind of roll it around. There you go, that looks great. And then we'll relax, maybe even shake out our hands to kind of let them feel relaxed and loose again. And then we'll come back and pick up our towel here. This time we're gonna do some leaning. So we'll come up through the center and then lean to the left. And center, we're gonna stay leaning to the left and to the left and center. Exhale, lean. Inhale, center, two more. And back to center, lower the arms to the side. Shake the hands out. Try not to grip this, by the way, it's a very light, light hold. All right, when we're ready, we're gonna do this to the right. Inhale up through center. Exhale, lean to the right. Center on your inhale. Exhale. And center. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Lower your arms, shake your hands out. <laughs> Good. Now I'm gonna to turn to the side so you can see what, we're, what I'm doing on my back side here. We're gonna take the towel and bend your left elbow and put it behind your back. <laughs> take your right hand, find it. So hopefully it's long enough that you can find. And you're gonna pull up with your top left hand and pull down with your right. And just feel a little squeeze there. You know, where I feel it is right here. See if you can lift your head up, straighten your back. And then we'll release that around, roll out your shoulders. Switch hands, take the Towel by your back on the right hand. Left hand goes around, tries to find it. Point your right elbow up and pull down with your left hand. Find your stretch. Mm. 
And then release your left hand. Bring your right hand forward. Back to your lap, shake it out. <laughs> now we're gonna take the, the towel in front of us, reach up, reach back. This time, see if you can push your arms further back and belly forward, keeping your chin tucked. And then exhale, exhale, exhale. Go out in front of your knees. And inhale, go up and back. Exhale, reach forward, pushing out in front of your knees. Tuck your chin in for the round it back. Inhale, come up, arch. Exhale, chin to chest. Reach out in front of you, lower the arms in front of your knees. Inhale, up. Exhale, down. One more round, inhale, exhale, all the way down. Lower your towel to your lap and lift your head up, sit back into some CT neutral stance, rest your arms by your side. Check back in. <laughs> Maybe notice how the neck, the shoulders feel. Good. Now we're gonna take this towel in front of you, reach it out, and then bring both arms to the left. So you're just pulling it over to the left, lift your head up, and then come back through center and to the other side, turn your head to the opposite direction. And center. To the left, look to the right. And center. To the right, look to the left. And center. To the left, look to the right. And center. To the left. <laughs> Reach both arms up. <laughs> Exhale the hands down. Take a second, check back in. <laughs> Our arms are starting to warm up. <laughs> now we're gonna take this underneath your right knee. So you're making like a little cradle here. Let's see that so you can see me better. And we're gonna just gently use the towel to guide up our knee. Just gonna lift and lower. But as you notice, we're using our arms just a little bit. The exhale is knee in, inhale is knee out. Exhale in. Inhale, out. These are hard. <laughs> One more. <sighs> and remove the towel from under your knee. Check back in and sit tall. And take it under the left side. To the left knee crease. Start with your elbow straight. Inhale here, exhale, lift it up, inhale, exhale as elbows bend. Smooth, long, smooth breaths. Just try to get it to smooth it out. Very nice, Ooh, two more. And then lower, foot down. Place this back onto your lap. Scoot to the middle or to the edge of your chair, not to fall out. We are gonna come into a forward fold. Actually, I'm gonna put my towel behind me so it doesn't fall off my lap. 
Start with your hands bound by your side. And we'll inhale both arms up. As you do that, lift your toe, lift your heels. So you come onto your tippy toes. And then exhale, we're gonna come down towards our shin. Inhale, look forward, reach your arms out, come back up onto your tippy toes and lower the arms. Inhale, both arms up, come up onto your toes. Exhale, reach forward, hands to your shins. Inhale, arms come up, heels come up. Exhale, lower down. One more, inhale. Exhale, reach forward. Touch your shins. Inhale, arms go out, heels come up. And exhale, arms come down. Grab your, your towel again. This time we're gonna put it on our, our foot. And you're just gonna rock it. A little hip opener here. If you didn't wanna use the towel, you could also just hold it. It's not gonna make much of a difference for this one. Good, and now we're gonna step the right knee out to the right side. So you're going to have the left foot forward, right knee out to the right side. And now we're gonna come back to holding our towel. <laughs> Inhale up. And then exhale, lean to the left. Inhale, center. Exhale, lean to the left. Center. One more, exhale. Inhale, good. Now turn so that you're feeling like you're turning towards your right knee. Reach your arms way out in front of your right knee. Reach out and then come back up. So this just gets a different angle of our back. Over the right knee and up. One more, reach forward and up. Lower your arms, rest. <laughs> now we're gonna go through the middle. So we went to the left, to the right, now to the center. Hands come, start down, holding onto it. Inhale up, exhale. It doesn't matter if you touch the ground, just bring your hands down, press into both feet and inhale up. Mindful of your back if it hurts. Exhale, come down. Inhale up. One more round. Exhale down. Use your legs, rise up. Exhale, arms come down by your side. Step your right foot in and pause. It's just kind of resetting with the pauses. <laughs> and now we'll lift the left foot up. You can put your foot in the towel if you want, or just hold your foot. And just make some gentle rocking motions. Little side to side. Good, and now we'll release the foot and step it over here to the left side. Shake out your hands if they're getting stiff from holding the towel. So I don't like holding the towel too much because I don't like my hands feeling grippy. So I try to keep them light, like really light holding onto it. I have to remind myself. All right, so we'll start facing 12 o'clock. Inhale the arms up. Exhale, lean to the right. 
Inhale, center. Exhale, lean to the right. Center. To the right. Center, last one, I love this one. Reach up and lean to the right. And center. Lower the arms. Turn to the right, left leg. So oh, we're gonna come up through the front, inhale. Exhale, reach forward. Oh, this side's stiffer, I know I can't go as far. Reach up. Exhale, come forward over the left knee. Inhale up. Exhale, reach forward. Up. One more time here. Reach out. And inhale up. Exhale, arms come down. Relax your shoulders. This time we go through the center. <laughs> Start with our hands down, inhale up, exhale, fold in between both legs. Inhale, use your legs to come up. Exhale, come down. Inhale, come up. Exhale down. One more time. Inhale up. Last one. And exhale down. All the way up. Lower your arms. Step your feet together. You can close your eyes here. Recognize the wonderful space you're creating in your body. Becoming healthy, happy, joyful. And see if you notice any sounds around you. And at springtime, maybe you notice birds. Maybe you hear a wash machine or a dishwasher or something working in the background. Notice how you feel in this moment, be present. And when you're ready, open your eyes, take your towel, put it to the back of your chair for now. And we're just gonna let the knees roll open and come to the pinky edge of your foot and then close the knees, bring them together, even squeeze your lower abdominal muscles here and roll them to the outside. Inhale, draw in, exhale, inhale. My feet are short, I'm putting my foot on blocks. <laughs> And really work that abdomen. As you exhale, the belly draws in and up. It pushes the lungs up and you get a, you empty out more of your lungs. You empty out more of the air, not your lungs. You empty out more of the air, creating a sense of relaxation in your body. So the exhalation creates a sense of relaxation. The inhalation creates a sense of energy. And in life, we want to find a balance. We don't want to be too relaxed. We also don't want to be too energized. I've met people in both situations that I'm like, man, that person could just be a slug. But I've also met people I'm like, whoa, they have way too much energy. <laughs> so as you think about our practices is trying to become balanced in these things. Good. When you're ready, just come back to stillness. 
And sit nice and tall. Take your two fists, place them in between your knees. That's about where your hips should be. Unless you've got a real, you know, your hips are a little bit wider. Some people have wider hips and that's okay. We're gonna lift your right foot off the ground and extend it. So press through the sole of your right foot and then bend your knee, lower the foot back down. Inhale, left leg comes up, push it out, straighten the knee, try not to hyperflex. Bend the knee, lower it down. Inhale, lift it up, right side. Exhale, mindfully push it away. Bend the knee, lower it down. Left leg, extend. Point your toes towards you if you can. Bend the knee, lower it down. Right leg, lift it up. Extend. Bend the knee, lower it down. You've got it. Just take your time, practice. We seek progress. Do not seek perfection. That doesn't exist. Just mindful movements here. One more to each side. And then pause. Come back to sitting nice and tall. Relax the shoulders down. We're going to take our hands and make a crisscross X shape on top of doesn't matter which hand you do on top, we'll switch it in a moment here. So just take notice, right? Which hand's on top? So holding on basically right below your, your collarbone, your clavicle here, lift your head up. So making your neck nice and long. And now tuck your chin in and bring yourself forward. You don't have to touch your knees. Just lean in this direction. And then inhale, come back up to a straight spine. In case you didn't notice, we're doing sit-ups. <laughs> we're not gonna call them sit-ups because no one likes to sit up. We'll just call them little forward folds. Lean forward. Inhale, come back. Exhale, come forward. Inhale, go back. Exhale, come forward. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Last one. Exhale. Inhale, back up. Notice which arm, where, which one's on the bottom, which one's on the top. And then release your arms, shake them out. Sit to the back of your chair for this one so that your back has something to rest on. Sorry for my long legged folks. Um, <laughs> we're gonna inhale both legs out and flex the feet, just like we did one at a time a second ago, but now we're doing both at the same time. Touch your toes down, inhale, exhale. Inhale, strong legs, exhale, soften. Inhale, extend, exhale, inhale, 
Exhale. Not hard too. Inhale. Exhale. Three more. Try some ujjayi breathing. In and out of your nose to breathe. Last one. Woo. And pause. Those are quite challenging. Now I'm gonna scoot more to the middle of my chair. So I've got a little room back there. And we're going back to that crisscross, but do the opposite arm. It's gonna feel weird because you're like, oh, this one doesn't feel exactly like the other one. Lift your head up and make your neck nice and long. And you don't have to press into your chest, just keep your hands soft. Lift up so you're straightening your back. Inhale here. Exhale, lean forward. Inhale, refine, get smoother. Exhale. Inhale back. Exhale down. Inhale back. Exhale down. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Last one going down. Exhale. Inhale, center. Uncross your arms, shake them out. Nice job. We're going to come to standing. So when you're ready, we'll stand up behind your chairs to work on a little balance and a little flow. Come to the back side of the chair. Feel all that work we just did in my abdomen. All right. Step your feet back far enough that you can keep your fingertips on the chair. So working on our legs just a little bit before we go into balance. Bend your knees, come into a squat. Ooh, strong legs. And then straighten the knees. Exhale, bend. Inhale, straighten. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, one more, exhale, inhale. Hold on to the chair with both hands and step back into a downward facing dog. Let's give yourself a second or two to stretch out here and breathe. Let your head fall in between your arms. You can put a soft bend in your knees to bring your belly closer to your thighs, tilting your tailbone upwards. Maybe you rock your upper body a little side to side. Gently come to stillness and rise up nice and slow. As you rise up, step your right foot to the chair. We're just going to arch the back. So hold on to the chair, arch the back, bring your shoulders back, bend into your right knee. And then step at the right foot back into downward facing dog. Push the hips out. Inhale, lift up your head, step your left foot to the chair. Bring your shoulders back and your head back, push into your right heel. Ooh, good calf stretch, right? Step back, downward facing dog. All right, 
lift up, right foot steps forward, bend into the right knee, shoulders go back, press into your left heel, step back, right leg, downward facing dog. Left foot steps forward, bend into your left knee, shoulders go back. And step back, downward facing dog. Rise up onto your tippy toes, lift your head up and come into a high push up. So you're just gonna lift the heels, lean forward. Hopefully your chair does not move. If it does, please don't do this one. You're gonna be chasing your chair down the hall. Lower your heels back to downward facing dog. We'll do that again. Inhale, lift up onto your heels as your head comes up. Exhale, lower your heels. One more of these. Inhale, lift up. Stay lifted up and tiptoe your way to the chair. Lower your heels, bend your knees, squat. We've been here. Inhale, lift the heels. Exhale, squat. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, lower the heels, stand back into Samasiti. Rest your hands by your, your waist. A second, catch your breath. Nice job. Step back with your left foot. Right foot's gonna stay forward. You may wanna toe heel it out to the right side some. Start with your hands down by your side, right knee straight. We'll inhale, bend into the knee as our arms come up into goal post. Keep your elbows near your ribs. And then exhale, bring your hands down as you straighten your right knee. Inhale. This is balancing. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale, two more. Good. Now push off left foot, step it next to right, check back in, rest. And step back with the right foot, toe heel the left foot out some, both hip bones are facing forward to the chair. Start with the knee straight, hands down by your side. Inhale, arms come out in front of you, palms will be forward, bend into your left knee. Exhale, straighten the knee, straighten the arms down. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, one more. And lower the arms, step in the right foot, pause. Coming into dancer pose next. We're gonna bend the right knee behind you. If you want, you can hold the foot. This doesn't really help. I was gonna say, use the towel. My towel is not long enough. Just bend the knee back. All we're gonna do is lean forward. And as you lean forward, try not to kick it out like we always do, but try to bring it in. Just try to lean forward and bring your heel closer. That feels right here in the quads. So as. And then take that foot down. It's also a very nice back bend. Try the left foot behind you. Bring the left heel to your left glute. Try to lean forward as you do bring your heel close to you. Uh, 
and lower it down. Give a little shake to your sides. And then toe heel the feet out wide so they're wider than your chair width. And turn your toes out just a little bit to the sides. Come out to a star-like pose. Take your left hand down or right arm up. Another big lateral stretch. And center. Let's take it to the other side. Star into the left with the right arm, center and to the right. Yes. Lower the arms. And now you can keep your feet out, out wide and come onto your forearms into a wide legged, like downward facing dog. You can push it out further. Let your head come in between your arms, your hands, your forearms can be stacked on one on top of the others. And just take a second to stretch this one out. Does a static like pose, we're breathing, and we're not moving. Now, when you come out of this, you have to come slow and lift your head up first. Hands come to the chair, and then lift up your upper body. And then toe wheel your feet underneath you. And come back to balancing in Samasiti. And resting nice and tall, shoulders back, your heads up. And breathe. Good. Come back and have a seat. That was a good job. Y'all did great. We'll find your towel again. I'm not done with him. Hold on to it in between your arm, your um, hands. You can start with it on your lap. And then inhale, arms up, look down this time. And now bring your arms down and look up. Look down as the arms come up, rounding the cervical spine. Inhale, lower the arms, look up, opening the front of your throat area. Inhale, look down, shrink in the belly. Exhale, look up. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale, arms up, look down. Exhale, arms come down, look up. Then come back to center, release your hands. Shake them out. And now we're gonna bring both feet, kind of angle them to the left. So you're sitting sideways in your, in your chair. We're gonna take the arms from one side to the other side. This is our twist. All the way to the right. All the way to the left. All the way to the right.
You can bring your arms lower if they start to get heavy. Slow it down. And come back through center. Turn back facing forward. Put your back up against the chair. Let's take three breaths here. Inhale through your nose. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more for luck, inhale, and exhale. Good, now turn to the right, so your knees will both, knees will face to the right side. And take your arms out in front of you, and twist to the left, and over to the right. Take your time. Start to get heavy, start to lower the arms. And slow it down. And lower. Good. Turn back through center, put your back up against the chair. I'm going to Take the towel, bring it to the floor here. And we're gonna take the legs out and point and flex, circle out your ankles. So if you can lift both legs at the same time, try that. If not, do them one at a time. And circle out the feet. Make sure your back feels supported against the back of the chair or sit nice and tall. And then just move the feet. And lower both feet back down. Take your hands, circle out the wrist. This movement you have to be specific. Good. Hands back to your lap. Inhale your right arm up. Look over your left shoulder. Reach through the sky. Exhale, right hand down as you do that. Look forward. We'll try that left arm. Left arm reaches up. Look to the right. We've done these a few times before. Exhale, look forward. Lower your left hand. I want you to do this as slow as you can. Inhale, slowly lift up your right arm, look over your left shoulder. Exhale, look forward as you do that, lower your right hand. Inhale, left arm up, look to the right. Exhale, look forward, lower your left arm. Right arm comes up, look to the left. Exhale, look forward. Last time, left arm comes up. Look to the right. Exhale, look forward, lower your arms. Bend your elbows, bring your chest forward. You can place your forearms on your lap 
You can even bring your hands to prayer. Option to keep your head up or tuck your chin in. And just feel a nice little stretch. This is sort of like a modified child's pose. If we were on the ground, our shins would be on the floor. Our arms might be out in front of us, but for here, we can just put our hands on our, el our hands together and our elbows on our legs. Slowly breathe in and out. And then lift yourself back up. Hands come back to your lap. If you want to take that towel you were using a moment ago, and place it over your head. It might not stay here, but if you sink closely into your chair, maybe you can cover your eyes. <laughs> if you can, you know, bring your sit bones to the edge and lean back. Maybe don't drop your head back, but just cover your eyes with the blanket, the towel, whatever you're using. If you don't want to do that, that's okay too. Let your body absorb all the work it just did. It's an important part of the process is the rest. It's an important process of our life is to rest. And the body heals itself when it rests. One day you will wake up and you will find that you've become a forest. You've grown roots and found strength in them that no one thought you had. You have become stronger and more beautiful and for, full of life. You have learned to take all the negative around you and turn it into oxygen for easy breathing. You will host wild creatures that live inside you and you will call them your stories. A variety of beautiful birds will nestle inside your mind and you will call them memories. You have become so incredibly self-sustaining. You are an epic proportion. And you should be so proud of yourself and how far you have come from a seed of what you used to be. The forest. Take a deep breath in. Exhale it out. Deep breath in. Exhale it out.
and gently allow your body and your mind to feel restored and awake. The poem I read to you was from Nagita Hill, Gill. Just wanna give credit where credit is due. I thought that was a beautiful poem. Stretch your arms out and up, stretch your legs, make your way into your day, by taking big morning stretches. And then hands to your heart. I hope you enjoyed your practice. May you be happy and healthy. And may you be kind to yourself and kind to others. Thank you. Namaste.